Okay, so I've had some people ask uh, if they could have my bezel art, and they said that they liked it. And um, so for the past two days, I've just been trying to perfect my Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle bezel art, since that's the one I kind of started on, you know, for the most part. And um, if I was going to pass it along to other people, you know, I figured the least I could do is try to make it look professional, you know. So, basically... This is the kind of stuff it looked like earlier, like, for example, like, when I didn't think I was going to pass it along to anybody, and it was just for myself, I had some stuff like this, you know, and I thought, oh, that's pretty cool, or whatever, but, like I said, I've been really working on it, and, uh, like, going in and just kind of inking, and it's not perfect, so sorry about that, like, I could do it better, but I think, like, the minimalist approach actually works well for this, but I don't know, we'll see if it's... It's not that great. Oh well. Anyways, um, and I just narrowed it down to bezels I think people would actually want to use. Let's go and turn this volume down. It's gonna be really low. <clears throat> okay, so here's our first bezel. Now, with this bezel, um, it doesn't have the little plastic in-screen bezel thing. This is a full screen. So if you use this, you'll just have uh, 1440 by 1080 natural uh, 4 by 3 aspect ratio, and um, Basically, uh, I went ahead and um, set it up so that screen that we just missed a second ago where it showed Leonardo top left, Michelangelo bottom left, Donatello top right, and then Raphael bottom right. I went ahead and aligned my turtles so that they'd be in the same orientation so that they match for the game. And also, like, you know, Leonardo's one player, and then down below, two player, up high, three player. Anyways, so it's kind of like more authentic, right? And then it like just thinking like if it imagine this was real bezel art on an actual arcade machine on the side I thought it'd be cool to kind of give it like a cursor light up effect like let's say you insert the coins or whatever and then bing, like a glowy cursor you know see like on and off you know <laughs> now if I could rig it up so that when you like select a character they, their cursor would glow that'd be really badass but I don't know how to do that so anyways, that's both of these bezel arts are full screen, you know, so one's glowy and one's not, whatever you guys like, whatever. And then I got some ones that have the little plasticky bezel, and I put the little Konami logo on there. The Konami logo was on a different bezel that came with the Metal Zoic pack, but it looks so good, I just went ahead and put it on this generic bezel. Um, and this is the one where it's not lit up, and then here's the lit up version with the little Konami uh, TV insert bezel thing and um, the aspect ratio of the game is is still good okay um, it's the same no matter which you choose it's a little smaller here to make room for the bezel but same aspect ratio so you don't have to about worry about it being warped or anything alright moving on let's say you get to the stage where you go underground you know into the sewers I thought it'd be kinda fun to go ahead and put in some Mausers now the mouses I had to start with, um, they were very flat, and then I was like, "That's kind of boring." So I spent a little while uh, trying to get them to pop out, and, and I also went back and inked these as well, and um, blended and used some inking techniques to just to kind of clean them up a little because the cartoon resolution was so low. Um, now this does kind of overlap a little, but it's I think it's fun. It's kind of a neat little effect you know and it'd be good for like the sewer level or something you know the Mauser's coming out to get you and then last that one I was working on just a second ago before I started recording um, I don't think it's 100% finished but I'm doing a mouse to try to draw these ink lines and I don't have like a stylus or anything so it's really hard for me to um, draw like good looking lines because I'm using a mouse you know like if you ever try to do like Mario Paint or Microsoft Paint you know just drawing with a mouse you'll know what I mean so I think this is probably safe and if I keep fiddling with it um, I'm gonna end up like drawing some really crappy looking lines and this is just enough to kinda make it pop uh, for people who like a cartoon bezel so I mean honestly this one's my favorite right here I think I think this one's the best but I include all these just so that you know you guys can choose which ones you want to play with you know what I mean alright moving on um, I'm gonna put a download link for you guys 
um, it's going to be my drop box and basically in the drop box is going to be a zipped TMNT ROM artwork file and you, when you take that you're going to need to drop it in here in your main artwork folder so just dr drop it in you can leave it zipped and that's the art and then I'm also going to include my any file so it'll be a zipped any what you want to do is extract it so it's an open folder any not zipped anymore and you can look inside and in the presets I'm going to have my mame.any you're going to want to put that in there okay uh, if, you don't have to but if, you know it, that way it, it, you'll have a, a nice any HLSL settings to go along you know with the art if you like and uh, if you're on a 1920 by 1080 monitor you're in luck because that's the monitor I'm using if you're on a different monitor that's not a 16 by 9 aspect ratio then sorry but it might not look good I don't know you could try using the cropped mode maybe um, but you know just give me some feedback in the comments and let me know how it goes so um, and I will be working on some more things in the future uh, I'm probably gonna be working on uh, Ninja Turtles 2 next and I'm gonna probably do like Secret of the Ooze uh, theme you know like Razor and Taka and you know, Shredder and uh, Tetsu or whatever. I don't even know. I'm just going to do some Ninja Turtles 2. And I'm also probably going to do some Alien vs. Predator. And I'll have like a, you know, a cool Predator image and Alien. And then maybe like a Ripley and a Schwarzenegger. Or something. I don't know. I'm going to make it fun. Uh, anyways, so uh, hopefully you'll enjoy those bezels.